Okay, what's up guys? Today I'm going to show you how to uh, do mini edits and stuff like that. So if you use theater mode, you're going to want to download a program, which is this one right here. And I'm going to have the link in the description. So you download that, install it, do that. So it's easy. All you do is copy the, the link in the top. Go to the program. You paste the link right there. It says input URLs. Now all you have to do, see it shows the name of the video right there. So I have to do it, click on download. Then it downloads. All the background uh, sound you can hear is my fucking brother, bitch ass nigga, and my little brother watching the TV. And playing PS3. So let me open Sunny Vegas. The videos they download as as MP4s, and uh, you could put on uh, you could put these videos on your PSP or whatever you have iPod. So I, now you now that the video is done, you click on that output folder. You open it. Oh wait, it's smaller. And then you just find the video name. YouTube Call of Duty Tomahawk Throw. So then you just drag it onto the timeline in Sony Vegas. And do that. So first you want to get rid of these black lines, right? Now wait, first you want to make your you want to go to properties. And you know, you want to make your video HD. So you go so you go to uh, file properties. And then the templates, you go to right there, 720, 30p. And yeah, it shows that. You're gonna put this 8 bit if, it's, if it isn't already. And you're gonna put that one to best, of course. And you hit apply, and then you hit OK. So now you wanna get rid of the black lines. You right click, hit video event, pan crop. And you wanna uncheck these two. You wanna make this null. You wanna drag the clip like that. And now you wanna put fades. You see the little fade offset right there? You just drag it. You have a little fade there. Put a little fade on the end. Replay it. You can do that. I'm gonna put it in slow motion when you get the kill. Uh, you just hit S to split, then go to wherever you want it, how long you want it to be slow. And you just drag this clip out. You hold Krill, then when you show that squiggly line, you drag it. Let me move this. When I just help Krill move this, like right there. So then you can just. <laughs> you can just right click on that, hit switch, mute it. Well, I'm not gonna put slow motion, so let me just undo that. If you wanna know how to undo it, uh, you hold Krill and you click on Z. So yeah, you do that. 
And now you want to do is you're going to go down to the video effects and you want to click on soft you want to go scroll down and go to soft and contrast. So now you want to you want to make that blur border. It's pretty cool. You just drag the warm vignette onto the video. Then uh, this window is going to pop up. And you want to go to vignette. You want to go to exterior effect. You want to put blur. That looks pretty cool. You want to put some contra contrast. Just drop it on there. Makes it a little darker. And I like putting a glow on it. So you're gonna put this white highlights. These are like more intense. I like this one. So you just put that there. If it's too much, you could bring down the intense city. Put a little bit of suppression. Suppression means that it, it like lowers it. Let me just render a little part of it. Not render it, but like that's the lighting. So yeah. Oh my God. Let me just take a little bit. Yeah, let me just put my here. Right click, video. Gonna put the intent more down. Can't even see the Tom Hawk. Stop. Alright, so on a right click video. Okay. You can just take it off. Let's see how it looks. Why is it doing that? Or whatever, and then you could just put a little song. Da, click on music. And just pick any random song. I think rock songs are really good for Call of Duty gameplays and stuff. So you can look for a rock rock song. Be Then To Me by Red. Good artist. So you want to just split the video right there. Delete this part. Fade it. The end. Fade it in the beginning. And uh... I think I synced it a little. So yeah, so yeah, if you want to render the, well, let me just try to fix this lighting. No, like, I right click, go to video, effect, event. Do it like that. So then, when you want to render it, you just file, render as, and you just click on Windows Media 11. It takes up less space, and you just click, you could just click on that one right there. But I made my own template, so I just it's the same thing. It's still it's still gonna be YouTube HD. So you click on save. 
and it's not going to take that much because it's just like a 30 second clip and thanks for watching guys peace